What's up, guys? Was the one-on-one guy back here? We're in Chelsea Court. I'm honored that Mr. Bones sent you to me on such important business in this time of crisis. Miss Marfley smiles with an amused twinkle in her eye. I certainly expected he would not perform the honor himself. If your man was taken by a clockwork, the solution is quite simple. Go look inside the clock tower. Go inside the clock tower. All right. 200 away. That is just going to it, though, not inside. Uh, if you were to go inside of it, being there, you would still be at 100. And... Oh, does it know we can just go over here? It used to be, uh, it didn't know you could go over here and it would tell you to go around that way. And, uh, I didn't notice that at first, so I went around a lot of times. Although, uh, like in the, uh, other places, it doesn't have this shortcut area. Anyways, Cat is over here. And, uh, we're gonna talk to somebody over there, Eyes I think. Peer through a hole in the door, and a voice issues from inside. Password? No password, no entry. Yeah, we're gonna talk to William Pugme and uh, maybe someone else over there. Quite a lot of different, uh, what do you call them, mobs here room in the streets that we don't have to fight. Oh, that's right, there was the teleporter hub right here. Word. Serious. This may require more effort than I thought. A gentleman with unsavory friends owes me a favor. His world insists on a show of power, so I must leave that to you. Find William Pugsby by Chelsea Tower. Tell him I sent you, and he'll help you with the password. Yeah, we can take the teleporter hub and pretty much be right here. Wow, I'm dumb. All right, you may be a wizard, but I don't talk to just anyone. But if Ms. Marfley sent you, I'll hear you out. You want to get into the tower, do you? Sheikh O'Leary changes the blasted password whenever he pleases. Sure, I associate with O'Leary's, but I'm as decent as they come. That Sheikh's is a right loon. Defeat Sheikh's at his hideout at the street, and he won't change the password out from under you. Alright, there's probably a teleporter over here for that. Two ice picks warehouse, two shakes clock tower. This is what we want right here. Yep. And, uh... I think, I think our, uh... Colossal Frog will do fine. You wanna play rough? Okay. Say hello to my little friend, Bruiser. This looks fine. Let's uh, attach this though, I guess. Do we have any more elemental treasure cards? No, okay. This will be fine now. Oh, he's got more health than I thought. It, like, Colossal Frog plus Banshee total is seven pips, right? But if you were to do, say, uh,. Just the scarecrow, it would be eight pips. So I guess I'm gonna switch over to doing the scarecrow. Uh, if bosses are gonna start having this much health, you know. Do we have the other trap? We do, and I mean, look at all these pips. Like we can't even, we aren't even attacking yet, and we have all these pips. We'd be able to hit soon, anyways. I 
And the minion also has a good amount of health. He's life, though, so this still might get him. Plus, we have this weakness. I think I'm just going to double Colossal Frog right now. Uh, not even worry about the weakness, really. Yeah, it looks like we're going to do... So, in the end, just as many pips as a Scarecrow. But we aren't healing ourselves. Oh, well. If I had a Scarecrow, what I would do is use a wand attack on the minion to get rid of the, the weakness on me right now and then Scarecrow next turn. And it's possible, wow, dude, how much health the boss has, I don't think a Scarecrow will actually kill him with that second Scarecrow, or with the second Colossal Frog. Yeah, Scarecrow is definitely better. Poor choice. Uh, you'll notice an obsidian chest over here that was on the right side. But I think that is one of the chests that you do not have to get anymore. If I'm not mistaken. It used to be that you had to get nine obsidian chests. But now you only have to get four. One from each world except Dragon Spire. And then, um, well, it used to, before that, it was two from each world, plus one in Dragon Spire. But they didn't, they never got rid of the old obsidian chests that you don't have to get anymore. So that's kind of funny. Uh, I guess we just have to Banshee next turn. Almost dead, too, wow. If I didn't get power pips like I did, it's possible I could have died in this battle. Talk to William Pugsby. I could port, but we don't need to. We might not need to do any sort of uh, marked location teleporting and just use teleporter hubs. A wooden chest. 46 gold, nice. Brilliant. With Shakes gone, no one can change the password. Bad luck he didn't have it on him. Shakes would have sent out the last password to the big muckers. That's not me, I'm decent. I wager Timmy Icepick has the password. Let's just say you don't want him to reach the clock tower before you. Defeat Timmy Ice Pig at the opposite end of the neighborhood. He'll have your password. And we can just use a teleport for that too. How much experience do we need? Okay. Is there something behind here? Sometimes you'll find like a silver chest or something behind here, which is nice. Is there any health relics? Or not health relics, health wisps? I guess not. I'll just use a, uh, one of those. And let's equip... Which one's better? This one. Let's equip this scarecrow. Don't be surprised if you find yourself a little chilly after this battle. And the rest of the stuff looks fine. Got wand attacks to deal with weaknesses and possible tower shields that he'll do. I'm going to get rid of just one in case of shields and weaknesses. Alright, I just checked on my calculator or something and with two traps and a blade on him, Scarecrow will kill Timmy Ice Pick. Um, maybe even with a weakness, let me see. Uh, it will not kill if I'm weakness. So, I just have to make sure no weaknesses or tower shields and we'll get them good. 
Well, we also don't have enough pips quite yet. I will probably just wand attack on Timmy Ice Pick that round. Um, like in case if there's a tower shirt or weakness that is placed on that round. So, yeah, this turn I won't have enough. Hopefully next turn I get a power pip and then I will have enough. I also only have one more wand attack after this, so maybe it'd be better to save it. Yeah, because in case if there's like two tower shields in a row or something weird. No power pip, come on. Oh, is that a tower shield? It's a nice blade, we're good. Now, hopefully we don't die next turn before we get to attack. Only one power pip, come on, we've got like 30 something percent chance. We should have had two by that time. I think we'll be fine. Hopefully we are. This better not kill me. This might kill me. Please don't kill me. Oh god, he's got a blade. I'm dead. I'm going to leave this in here so you all can see my failure. Okay, so what we're going to do is add in some tower shields and a pixie and we'll be fine. Let's use this and go back. Wow. Dying in Marleybone when I have such an awesome pet. How bad am I? I'm terrible at this game, guys. I am just completely garbage at this game. Yeah, like those two turns that I passed, I could have shielded and I would have been safe. Ah, oh, I love it when they blade each other like that. Cause he's not gonna use an ice spell and he's not gonna use a myth spell. They're just losing out on damage they could have. I promise not to die this time. I promise. If I do, I'll probably just skip to the end and show you all that. I won't make you suffer anymore. Um, some news about the channel. I am learning how to use Photoshop and stuff. And I plan on making like a banner for the channel, uh, I'll be having a better avatar, and I'll uh, have better thumbnails for you all. I might add in more graphics during gameplay if it seems fit, rather than just the one at the end. So, you know, it might, you know, your general experience on my channel, watching my videos, uh, will look better. So, this video should have a nice looking thumbnail. I might have a banner up at the time this is posted. I might not, I'm still working on it and looking at different ideas. I actually knew a little bit of Photoshop already, but I am um, looking more in depth now. And Tower Shield, that's annoying. Well, maybe it's, oh, I don't have any more uh, wand attacks, I deleted them all. So I guess I will just Scarecrow and then save up for a Banshee on this guy. It's unfortunate. Oh, I already have a new avatar actually. And it is no longer with my Storm Wizard as the face it is this death wizard as the face and i think it looks better overall too i did some cool stuff with it uh but however i'm also thinking of i it i feel like it doesn't look good enough you know i always want things to look better so there might be a new one even later it also has my current clothes equipped as what it is, so I might change it when I get 
a different hat or robe, who knows. Oh, that's great. Fizzle. Oh, I would have new clothes like the video after this one because I'll be level 25 and I'll put on new clothes then. At least a new robe. And then level 30, I'll hopefully I'll get some uh, Senator or Zeus drops and put that hey, on. Hey, I can't believe I was put on ice by such a little wizard. Don't tell anyone, okay? You find a piece of paper with today's date and a password. All right, nice. Oh, we actually did end up using one port. No, we didn't. Well, we used, we ported back into the boss dungeon area we were in. Not a marked location port, though. We kind of used one. Thanks for that. They must be on to us. Right, you've got the password. Afraid it's gotten too dangerous for me. We can't all be wizards. I pay my debts, I do. Tell Ms. Marfley I did what you asked. Best of luck, wizard. All right, and going back to Miss Marfley. That is not the right teleport. Where is it? Hooligan Hangout, that sounds interesting. Two balloon car, this is where it is. I'm glad William Pugsby could help you, but I'd rather not know what you had to do to get it. I've been observing the clock tower. There's no better time than now to rescue your man. Use the password and enter the clock tower. Take care. And this would be the last battle for Chelsea Court. I I feel I think we had to do more battles. Uh, previously, like we'd have to fight gearheads and whatnot. Uh, Eyes peer through a hole in the door, and a voice issues from inside. Password? Once you give the password, the door creaks open. Ha! <laughs> this kind of looks like a surprised face, being uh, the two gears being eyes, and then the door being an opened mouth. That was cool how it opened there. So yeah, I think we used to have to fight gearheads over there, and maybe some other stuff. Um, they've made a lot of areas quicker, though. What? You're not supposed to be here. I'll have to drop kick you into next week. Like as more and more areas are added, you know, it takes longer to go through the game, so they're making it easier for new people, I guess. Oh, this guy doesn't have like any health at all. Well then, I just pretty much need to blade once and then scarecrow. I think we might have a fight after this, though. I'm not sure. See, there's an elevator there. I think we might go up it. Not 100% on that. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yes. The uh, videos are getting shorter than they have been. This is something I wanted, though. Because I felt that they were... They were too long, you know? A lot of them were like an hour or longer. I think this, you know, I finally had one that was like less than 30 minutes. Um, I want them to be closer to about 20 to 30 minutes per episode right now. Uh, some episodes will be longer though. Um, like if I'm soloing a dungeon, it might take a while. So after this, after this, I might have a long episode, too. Or, not right after this, but sometime around now. Once I hit, uh, well, that would be Wisteria. I plan on doing Wisteria, but I might do it all in one video. I don't know yet. Um, so what I was gonna say is... Once I hit level 25, I have two things to do. Wisteria and, uh, Kembalung Village. Actually, I'm going to finish Marleybone first, and then I'll do Wisteria. But I will do Kembalung Village as I, like, right after I'm level 25. So that will probably be after I am done with 
uh, the ironworks, which is after this. I thought I'd seen my last day. I can't thank you properly, so I won't. At least not now. I hear Mr. Bones will pay for my information. The O'Leary's have a big plan. You'll see. But they got designs on me as well. I should be going. Give my thanks to anyone who helped find me. Uh, I'm not quite sure if he's still a bad guy or if he's saying he's a good guy after that. And if he's a bad guy, could we not have just captured them right there? We can use this to get there quicker, I guess. So we did end up using one. You found him! I never doubted you would. A pleasure working with you, young wizard. I'm sure I'm not the only one who's impressed. Speaking of Mr. Bones, you best run off to see him at Digmore Station, where he's coordinating with the police. Tell him I said hello. Alright, and this is the last thing we will be doing for this episode. This episode's looking to wrap up around 22 or 23 minutes long. In the area that I'm wanting. My thanks. I spoke with Baxter a moment ago. I could not have done better myself. What? Miss Marfley said hello? Sherlock, adjust his collar. <laughs> That's hilarious. Excellent. Excellent indeed. Your daring escapades have led me to conclude we must meet away from prying eyes. Baxter will meet us at my home at 221 Barker Street in Regent Square. We'll have these O'Leary's yet. Oh, <laughs> this is too funny. All right, I will leave talking in Sherlock Bones' house for the Ironworks episode, as that is what all those talks have to do with. And then after Ironworks, um, I'll take a crack at Kensington Park. If I can't get that, then I will do Kembalung Village, and then the rest of Marleybone, and then maybe take another crack at Kensington Park, and if not, then do Wisteria. So, see you next time, guys. Bye. You managed it, did you? Regular lot of convicts with all these lockpicks, aren't they? No time to muck around. Take these lockpicks to the Hyde Fraternity House in the upper left-hand corner of your map. Beat this now, somehow, some way. I I don't really have a plan for how I'm going to do that. 